Hey guys, it's Di from Be Mommy with Style. I thought I'd do a little mini day in the life today, although it's like midday. But it's a good thing that I didn't plan on going to the Polar Express party today. That was today at their school in Natalie's class. His today didn't really go as planned, so I went to work this morning and I got a phone call. They had a half day today anyways. But I got a phone call around nine o'clock. Natalie was sick, I needed to come pick her up. So I picked her up, we went to urgent care. She's got a double ear infection, poor thing. She is sacked out in her room. And when that's how it goes with her. When she gets ear infections, they just come on quick. And we thought both tubes are out when we went to the ENT last week. He pulled one out and he thought the other one was already gone. But she actually had, the other one actually came out of her ear because she had flu coming out of her ear. Um, sorry, this is too much information. <laughs> um, she had the other tube come out too. So it actually apparently was still in there. So they prescribed her antibiotics and ear drops and she just feels miserable right now, you can tell. But we got the medicine, so hopefully in a day or two she'll be feeling better and she's gotta be on that medicine for like 10 days. But usually it starts working pretty quickly and especially after some of that drains off, it really helps. But um, our follow up with the ENT is in January, so it should be interesting to see what they decide as far as the next set of tubes. Are we gonna do them? Are we gonna wait? So we're waiting to see on that. But she is under the weather today. So we'd already planned my mother-in-law was coming over to hang out with the girls, both of them, since today is a half day, so my husband and I could work. But things kind of changed rapidly this morning that they called me to come pick up Natalie and I took her to urgent care because the ENT is gone for the holidays. There was, I called over there, there was no way we could get in. He's gone for the holidays. Um, so we went to urgent care and then Dan went and picked up his Mel at school and then we all converged back in the house so that Anna could watch the girls. Although Natalie's just asleep. She'll probably be asleep the rest of the day. So anyhow, I got them all settled. I went and got them lunch. So I'm gonna go head back to work for a little bit. Try to get some more work done because I was like right in the middle of working on something. And then I got the phone call. So I was like, ah, do I finish this? Do I not finish this? I don't know. But I'm gonna go back to work real quick. And then um, we'll probably have dinner tonight and just hang around the house. And the girls are off school the next two days. So Anna's supposed to be hanging out with them the next couple of days. And then my mom's gonna hang out with them next week. So they've got lots of grandparents hanging out the next couple of weeks. We're, we're having a Salsa Rita's taco bar party here. It's pretty good stuff. It's the first time we've ever had it. My salsa is actually fairly hot. So the kids are officially on Christmas break now and Natalie is unfortunately very under the weather. She didn't even want to come downstairs for dinner. So I'm going to take her some chips upstairs and a banana and if she eats anything, she eats something. If she doesn't, that probably would be par for the course tonight. But um, that was the first time we had salsa readers. I have no clue whether it's a local thing or if it's just in the south or if it's just in this region. But it was really good. I would definitely eat there again. And it was actually really good for like if you have a crowd of people, like even more than, well we would have had five if Natalie would have been downstairs, but the four that we had, um, because my mother-in-law was still here for dinner. So um, you could order like, it's called a fiesta pack and it's like, you know, feed five and up people, which honestly I think it could feed six or seven to be honest. So it worked out really, really well and it's pretty good. So Bella's over here watching Spirit on Netflix. And she's kicking off her break with some relaxation. I'm gonna try to clean up the kitchen a little bit and work on some editing. And that is gonna be it for our evening. So Natalie is down and out for the night in her room. She's resting. It's about time for Isabella to go take a shower, but I thought I'd show her little tree with all these ornaments that she made on it. She just put this one on there that she painted. She made this one out of puzzle pieces. Puzzle pieces, paper, a mouse. Um, this thing, and a Merry Christmas thing, and it's a good Mom, job. You made ornaments out of Cheerios. You made ornaments out of Cheerios. <laughs> Those ones probably didn't last super long. Well, most of the time, it just ended up with a bunch of kids eating glue-covered Cheerios. Oh, yeah, I heard about that face. Ew. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> I totally have that on camera. <laughs> so as the end of our evening, we are going to go watch Cars 3, I think, and we're going to screen it before the kids watch it and then probably watch it with the kids either tomorrow or the next day. So that's it for our evening. Thanks for joining us for Vlogmas, and I'm going to be hopefully doing 
what the kids are getting for Christmas very soon and also uh, Christmas is coming up five days away today so four basically almost now. So that's it for today. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.